Um, like that home court advantage that came out tonight, and because uh, in first, I think when we played those top two teams, especially the two that came out and hit us first, and we knew that we wanted a chance to win the game, we had to come out and um, play without end game, we did that tonight. How did you rank this win, just based on this season and what you guys have been able to do? And I know Coach Pierce mentioned Philly was special, but this win in particular, where is this spot? Yeah, I really like this win because uh, we were really, really short-handed on top of that, and I think everybody did a good job of setting up and playing a role and doing it well. And uh, the guys are winning. It's a really good team tonight. So it just shows us, you know, what the signature coach's plan and signature, you know, our role as an individual for a team. How the rest of your teammates, but specifically the bigs, able to exploit their defense in the paint? Um, just knowing the scouting report, coaches told us that you know, keep our hands ready, they guard too much for the ball, they switch a lot, so we know um, it's going to be empty for trying to get the ball down low and capitalizing on those easy switches and uh, really playing, playing to our strength in the pick and roll. Uh, I think we did both of them. And, and Trey, your teammate, had a fantastic game as well, another double-double for him. And, and for him to be able to do that against the team he grew up through before, that's got to be pretty special to see your teammate succeed like that. Yeah, he's just playing, uh, playing some really good basketball right now. Uh, for him to you know, come out and play the way he did, whether they were pressure, pressuring him all game, for him to be you know, as calm and cool and collective as he was, uh, shows his growth early in, the, early in the year, early in his career, and I like what it's going so. Take me to the end of the game where you guys really did have to kind of fight back in that fourth quarter to start, and then you got the lead and you just maintained it. How did you do it? Oh, we knew OKC was going to make it work uh, for sure. You know, we're, we're one of the better teams in the league, so uh, I think that was like an afterthought for us. And we just knew uh, what we had to do once they made their run, and that was weather the storm and come back and play solid basketball, uh, score we needed to, and get big stops. We got a lot of big, uh, big steals. A lot of energy, a lot of energy in the building. We just we played off that and got with it. In a big picture sense, the Hawks have been doing pretty well lately, right? What, what's your overall thought about just how important these particular wins are to the growth of this team? Yeah, I mean, you know, when you, if you ask anybody outside the locker room, I think they'll tell you a different story. But inside the locker room, I feel like, or well, at least I think we feel like, uh, we're not that far off. Um, and I think, like, a win like this tonight proves it. Uh, like I said, I think we have enough, um, enough firepower just to do what we want to do on, on both ends of the court. It's just a matter of us knowing what we have to do as, as players, as individuals, and coming together as a team and trying to figure that out. Um, I don't think we're that far behind, though. Can you get three days off? What are you going to do? I don't know. I, that seems like, a, you know, that feels like an eternity in NBA days, but I'm definitely going definitely gonna to rest, try to take care of my body, and get ready for this uh, this grueling road trip we got coming up. And do the ice bucket right here. Your ankle. Yeah. Yeah. About that. You're going to do it? Uh, I am. Yes. It's on Eventually. <laughs> no problem. No problem. Oh, that was the worst, man. John, I wanted to ask you, um, so of course on the team you're kind of known as the dunk master, uh -huh. besides Vince, of course, but currently, about? currently, <laughs> um, <laughs> the current one, but what's your uh, opinion on DeAndre's dunks there to end the game? He said you Drake, guys were kind of getting on him about. Around, but Drake has a lot in his bag that he never really pulls out. He's a real athletic guy, so I'm happy just to see him finally get out there and show what he has because we, we all know he's been having – he had that and he's been saving it. So. Okay. So we know what would you rate one. them? Uh, that one look he had today. Mm -hmm. uh, that, that one cradle, I'll get that. Like, a, like an eight, it was in-game. You know, he looked back, made sure there was no defense. <laughs> Solid. I like it. I'll give it an eight.